What's up, everybody? Um, it's your boy, I'm here for breakfast. I had a bagel for lunch. I'm probably gonna have some beans and some cornbread and maybe some other stuff too. We'll see what happens. Uh, I'm just hanging out today. I woke up at five today. I exercised. I um, walked for nine miles. I burned 1,644 calories and my average heart rate was 139 and that went pretty well, um, you know. Uh, I don't know. I'm just hanging out. Uh, it's pretty sunny outside, but there's like clouds everywhere. Like, it like, you look at the ground and you would assume that the sky is sunny, but then you look up and it's just clouds. Um, so yeah, that's what's happening outside. And, uh, you know, nothing else is really going on. Um, once I was done exercising, I took a shower and now I'm working on, um, a Windows 11 VM actually. So on my, uh, hmm, I guess we'll see if the display is correct. Um, but on my really popular Arch Linux video, um, which by the way, is no longer the most popular video on my channel. It's like the video where I most recently had COVID. It has like 2.1 thousand views. I don't know why it's really unusual. Um, but on that video, which is now my second most popular video, um, someone said, uh, to be fair, VirtualBox is terrible. When I was referring to how I couldn't get VirtualBox working on Debian, I was like, how is VirtualBox terrible? And they didn't respond. Uh, but him saying that sort of piqued my curiosity because I had never really looked into, you guys don't need to, had sort of piqued my curiosity because I had never really looked into alternative VM systems other than VirtualBox. Um, and I think at the time I started using VirtualBox, there weren't many others or they weren't as good as VirtualBox. Um, but now, you know, there's QEMU. And, um, ah, oh, my display thing didn't work. Well, maybe I just need to sign in. Hold on. Maybe it needs to have the service run or something. Come on. You've got this. Anyway, um, so that sort of piqued my interest. I started doing some research on my own. And uh, it turns out QEMU is just way, 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 way faster than VirtualBox. Um, by like kind of a large margin. Of course, this doesn't look like it, but um, you know, I swear it's faster, guys. Oh, there you go, there's Windows 11. Um, for some reason, my display driver isn't working. Um, I don't know if you guys can see this, but um, I did install um, Spice, which is sort of like VirtualBox guest editions on here. Um, and that has resulted in my mouse sort of, you know when you install guest editions onto a VM and your mouse stops being laggy in the VM? You know what I'm talking about? Like, it was like that. And, uh, you know, I'm pretty sure if I install Spice, it should have, um, it should have, oh, never mind. Maybe I have to do Vert Viewer or something. Um, because I remember, because I'm using Vert Manager right now and I actually think I might have to do Vert Viewer for Spice to work with the display and stuff, but we'll see. Um, yeah, so you know when you get guest editions on a VM and the mouse stops being laggy? Uh, that's happened, and that's how you can tell I've gotten guest editions, because this is sort of acting like native mouse performance, which is really nice. Um, and I don't know, that's pretty much it. Um, I forgot to mention on yesterday's video, let me move my VM over. I think there's some hair on my face. Okay, the hair on my face is no longer tickling me. Um, yeah, so I changed my... V my uh, my Firefox settings a little bit. So now it's sort of a one tab setup I have. Um, I made the colors on Firefox the same colors as um, YouTube. Um, and I made that the same color as my bar up here. Cause I typically have YouTube open. I don't know if I mentioned this yesterday, but anyway, yeah. So my tab bars are shorter and that's the main thing. I made my tab bar shorter. Um, so it kind of looks like compact mode. It's a little shorter than compact mode, I believe, but yeah, that's just cool. Um, yeah, the reason why I'm getting a Windows 11 VM is because I feel like it's just good practice. Um, I don't know, it sort of sucks to like not have a, have a working Windows VM and just need to run something on Windows for some reason, like you need to do something for school or something. Um, and you just, you just can't and it sucks, you know? So I have to go out here or something to like, do like install, like it's just so irritating. It's a really bothersome. So um, I got a Windows 11 VM uh, and I got Windows 11 because Windows 11 is the newest version of Windows and Windows 10 is going to be deprecated pretty soon, I'm pretty sure. Um, you know, my dad's work laptops just got Windows 11. Um, so I, you know, it just felt like the choice that made the most sense. Uh, and it's actually funny, this used to be my wallpaper. 
Um, I actually changed it yesterday. Um, yeah, I changed it yesterday to this. Um, but it used to be... Um, the wallpaper is just called Windows 11. It used to actually be this. Um, so... Oh, did I just dock something? Mm, we're fine, that doesn't matter. Um, yeah, so... So, um, yeah, same, same wallpaper, which is sort of, sort of crazy. Yeah, but I use this one now because it works better with the purple border. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope everybody has a good day. And, um, yeah. Oh, I got school today. <laughs> I forgot to mention that. I have school today. Um, and yeah, all right, see you dude.